website is teamchicago.tv, teamchicago.tv. We're on Lake Winnebago, Oshkosh, Wisconsin. We're working with the Beaver Motorcycle Club, they're the promoters. We're working with the Otter Street Fishery to raise money, take care of the fish, docks, stocking the fish, everything in Lake Winnebago here. But the motorcycle racing, the quads, I'm gonna show you in the next 10, 12 minutes, all the highlights and some really fast action right here in Oshkosh, Wisconsin. And don't forget my website, teamchicago.tv. Hold this up again, hopefully, get get decent amount of crowds, get some decent purse money, that kind of stuff. But I did go out and knock on some doors. We do have three sponsors for the event, Metro Motorcycle, Titler Cycle, and Team Winnebago Land. So there should be cards out here somewhere, John. Make, make sure they get back out here. I didn't get that out right away. Just sign your name and put your racer number on there. I'm gonna mail that back to them. They're, they're gonna be getting some value for their money. And then hopefully they give us more money next year. That's what I'm hoping to get to. So, uh, like I said, if you didn't sign the card, please take your time just to put an autograph on there. Okay, the other thing we got was EVS Sports in the last minute sent me 50% off retail for their, their stuff. And they make knee braces and helmets and that kind of stuff. If you didn't get a certificate, we have some in the trailer. Take one with you. It's good till end of March. So they, they want to help you be safer and you get 50% off retail, which is pretty much what sponsors do for sponsored riders. So please take advantage of that. You have to call them, but they uh, send it to you at half off. Uh, also support the fishing club, go get something to eat, drink, buy some raffle tickets. This is how they make their money. Uh, so have fun. I think that's about all I need. I don't have the last So as Mike Sportsenbacher so you know, continues the, the, the riders meeting, whatever. Mike Sportsenbacher uh, from so Beaver show, Cycle Club. We're on Lake so Winnebago, Oshkosh, Wisconsin, with the Otter Street Fishing Club. As we watch the 250 class line up, ready to go. Waiting for the green flag to fly. Jumping off the line, it looks like number 24, Max Smith right there. Sonny Johnson's number 68. But off the line in the lead is Austin Madison. Austin Madison from Jefferson, Wisconsin on that Rock River Power Sport, Jaranac Power Systems. Yamaha has got the early lead. We see Smith down on the inside trying to get by Johnson. Smith 24, Johnson on that 68 Honda. Behind this duel, we see Chesney Bolton, number 19 battle with number 90, that's Brandy Lane. Chesney Bolton, the only gal out there racing in the 250 class and she also rides in the quad class. Running in fifth place as we swing the camera around. Up front, it's a battle between Johnson, that is Sonny Johnson, Sonny Johnson from Mount Calvary, Wisconsin. He's from the Johnson Auto Body. Diane Johnson, Havbeck Motors, Max Schmidt. He's running in third place, sponsored by Team Smith of US Chrome, Grease Monkey Garage, X-Brand Goggles, and AXO Racing. As they come to the line, photo finish. And as we slow it down, the judges rule that the win was Austin Madison on that Rock River Power Sport Yamaha over Sonny Johnson. And now we're at the action in the ADCC class. Up front, that is Ethan Rosine. Ethan Rosine from Eden, Wisconsin. He's from that Rosine family. They build some of the best ice racing tires. Another brother from the Johnsons, that's Nick Johnson from Mount Calvary running second. Loyal Parch from Milwaukee is running in third place. But in this 85cc race, Ethan Rosine will not be denied as he goes on to pick up the win. 85 cc nick johnson is second royal pass finished in third place now we're looking at the quads we got some pro quads and we got the open quads battling it out on this quarter mile ice track the ice is approximately 14 inches thick good enough to park a car out there 
That is Zach Swartz. He's on that Honda. He's a local boy out of Oshkosh. Giving him some battle is Hayden Ritz. Hayden Ritz from Monroe, Wisconsin. He's also on a Honda. He's sponsored by Oregon Coastal Power Sport. Behind this battle in Tucson, 45, is Taylor Hoosman on that Hoosman Construction Honda. Right with him is his teammate. That is Brandon. Ganya also on a Hoosman Racing Honda. Oh, Taylor Hoosman, the fire has gone out in the blowhole. He is out of this race. Up front is still Zach Switz, and he's from Oshkosh. He's sponsored by JFS Racing, Magoo Speed Shop, and Dunright Construction. Earlier, he had a chance to talk to Travis Sadler and Brandon Ganya. As we see Hayden Ritz battling with Sadler for second place on this quarter mile ice course, Lake Winnebago. Travis Sadler, run a Honda 450, flat track here at Otter Street, local boy. Um, either out front or in the rear, and we'll see how it goes. Got a couple sponsors I'd like to give a shout out to One Stop Loop Shop, Auto Works Unlimited, Big Nell Motorsports. Stadler Motorsports, they do a lot for me. I can't, wouldn't be here if it wasn't for them guys. They're the one pushing me every step of the way. Gotta thank them. Last year we won here by about three quarters of track in the, in the B class, so hopefully we're gonna move up to the open class today and give them, see if we got something for them there. It's Brandon Ganya here at Otter Street. Um, I love coming here. I've raced here probably three years. I got a new four-wheeler this year. Um, I'd like to thank my Houston yeah. Racing Team and Houston Homes. Other than that, we're about to have a blast. Thank you, gentlemen. As we see Zach Wurtz, he's still up front on that JSF Racing Magoo Speed Shop, Dunright Construction. The battle for second heats up between Travis Sadler and Hayden Ritz. They're coming out of turn. Whoa! Sadler is down. It is Hayden Ritz going on to pick up the win in the open class. Second place went to Keegan Ritz. Third place went to Brandon Ganya. And Chesney Bolton was fourth place in that open class. In the pro class, it was Zach Switz picking up the win. And now we're looking at the action. This is open twins vintage up front. We got a Yamaha up front with a Triumph running second. Up front, it is that Todd Lefebvre. Danny Brand on that number 88 Triumph is now battling with Dan LaShawn on that number 20 Triumph. Danny Brand, uh, the promoter of the half mile races at Elkhorn, has now just jumped up and he's caught up with Lefebvre on the Yamaha. Moran is on the outside, number 88, 16 is that Todd Lefebvre. On the inside, Joe Stoppelworth on that 16X Yamaha is in fourth place as we see Veranda driving around Todd Lefebvre. The Triumph is now up front, Danny Veranda, genuine go fast out of Wisconsin. And earlier, I had a chance to talk to the man that prepares his track, Joe Stoppelworth is going to tell us about racing at Oshkosh. Joe Stoppelworth up here at the Otter Street Fishing Club uh, Fishery in beautiful Oshkosh, Wisconsin. Uh, we're here to put on a motorcycle ATV ice races and uh, we've been working on this track for the last two weeks. Weather's been uh, great and uh, we, we, we love this place. We want to thank the Otter Street Fishing Club for everything they do for all the fishing uh, and, uh, and for walkers, the people that walk on the trails and uh, docks and piers and uh, the fish conservation. So let's have a great ice race. Go Team Chicago. Thank you, Joe. As we see this battle between Dan LaShawn on the Triumph and Joe Stoppelworth on the Yamaha for third place. Joe Stoppelworth is sponsored by Pro Motorsports, Joe's Custom Cable. Yes, he makes cables for your motorcycle and Otis Moto. Joe and Dan continue to battle. Dan, who won here last year on his Triumph, is struggling this year as we swing over and we see Danny Veranda. Danny Veranda, the promoter of the half mile races 
at Elkhorn, Elkhorn, Wisconsin, Wadsworth County Fairground. He is leading second place to Todd Lefevre, but it is Veranda going on to pick up the win in the big twins class, Lake Winnebago. And now we're looking at the Canadian screw class. I should point out that Canadian screws are approximately twice as long. The head of the screw is closer, to, greater than a quarter inch off the top surface of the tire compared to the American screws, which are allowed only to go to 3 sixteenths of an inch off the top of the tire. So the Canadian screws offer a great advantage as recent as battle for the lead between Parker Lane, number 57, number 17, that's Nick Smith and Christian Johnson. Christian Johnson is riding in his dirt track mode, but I believe the faster way around is you just lay the bike over. You don't have to let off the gas when you got these Canadian screws moving up front. That is Parker Lane. Parker Lane is sponsored by Mike's Motorsport, DJ Slosser, Bell Helmets, Moose Racing, Murray Salvage, Bearded Guys, Benny Carlson. Also making the move now is Nick Smith. Nick Smith on that Smithy Racing, Mom and Dad, Chris Baker. But you can see the traction that is given with these Canadian screws give a big advantage. And going on to pick up the win, Canadian screw race. It is Parker Lane up front, Nick Smith second, Christian Johnson third, and Brand Toma is in fourth place. We are now looking inside the beer tent. This is a major fundraiser for the Otter Street Fishing. They, this club was created in 1961 for the betterment of fishing on Lake Winnebago. They also hold an ice fishing contest on this Saturday. It's the first Saturday in February. This club helps stock the lake, Lake Winnebago, maintain the docks, maintain the piers, work on the trails around Lake Winnebago. And remember, website and on Facebook, it is Otter Street Fishing Club on Facebook. And now we're looking at the action. The 450 amateur class jumping out front. It is Sonny Johnson. Sonny Johnson is sponsored by Diane Johnson, Headspec Motors, Johnson Auto Body. As we see the battle in place, that is Caleb Larson on that 719 on the batting with Tyler Rosine, 22. Rosine John, is sponsored by John Rosine, who built some of the best ice race tires, and he says he's sponsored by mom and dad. Caleb Larson is from Fort Atkinson, Wisconsin. Fourth place looks like Mike Moore. Mike Moore on that legacy automotive Yamaha. Battle for second continues to shape up. Running away with this race, though, is that Sonny Johnson. Sonny Johnson is flying out there as we now see Taylor Rosine locking up second place, moving up and trying to challenge him. Is that Mike Moore? Mike Moore on that Legacy Automotive Yamaha trying to run down that Taylor Rosine. But up front, as the spectators look on and going on to pick up the win, it is Sonny Johnson. So it's Johnson in first place, Rosine second, Moore was third, Larson was fourth, Madison was fifth, Fosek was sixth, and Brandon Parker was in seventh place in the very fast 450 amateur class. Now we're gonna get the senior race I'm showing the footage from my heat race because the footage from the heat race was much clearer than the footage from the final. But the senior class, I got the ride. Joe Stoppelworth's 490, YZ 490 Yamaha. It was a rocket ship. I had a great time. But in the final event, going on to pick up the win, senior class is for riders over 40 years old. Brad Bolton went on to pick up the win. Serge Belusi was in second place. Mike 
Grampentine was in third place, Todd Lefevre was in fourth place, Jeff Wick was fifth, Patrick Ryder was sixth, Chris Baker was seventh, Joe Stoppelworth finished in eighth place, Dan LaShawn was ninth, and I finished in 10th place. I was just not fast enough on Joe Stoppelworth's absolutely beautiful YZ490 Yamaha. What a great motorcycle. As we see some of the kids wrestling around, thousands of spectators came out to see the ice race. Thousands of people came out to support the Otter Street Fishing Club, and the final event is the Open Pro Race. Jumping out front, that is Christian Johnson. Christian Johnson's on that. Mom and Dad, Grandma and Grandpa's, Hesbeck Motors, Johnson Auto Body, Honda. Battling behind them, rider from Green Bay, Wisconsin. That's Kyle Weiss. He is battling with Block Schwarzenbacher. Block Schwarzenbacher is sponsored by Millennium Tech, Power Sport Company. Kyle Weiss is sponsored by Dell Psycho, part specialist in Bay Exhaust. Right there also is Brad Rosine from the famous Rosine family. The Rosine, John Rosine, built some of the greatest ice race tires. We see number 30, that is Black Schwarzenbacher. 29 is Kyle Weiss. But as these three bikes are battling, it is Christian Johnson running away with the open pro class right here, Lake Winnebago. And as we jump ahead, we can see that Black Schwarzenbacher is now ahead of Kyle Weiss. As we see Christian Johnson up front. And earlier I had a chance to talk to Christian Johnson and Black Schwarzenbacher. Hi, I'm Christian Johnson. Uh, we're here today at Outer Street Fishery Fishing Club running the annual Outer Street race they have every year. Um, the turnout's pretty good. Uh, uh, Joe Stopper at the Beaver Side Club usually do a good job of putting it on. Uh, number 30 in the pro expert class and a few of the, I think we're on a Canadian class here today at Oshkosh. Uh, part of the uh, Otter Street Fishery here in Oshkosh. It's always a lot of fun. There's always a big crowd and uh, yeah, just pumped, ready for the action to start, you know. It's Thank you, gentlemen. As we see Fox Schwarzenbacher ahead of Kyle Weiss, Jake Drummond has now moved up to fourth place. Brad Rosine had a problem with his bike because he drops off the fifth place. But it is Christian Johnson from Mount Calvary, Wisconsin. He has got the hot hand. It is Christian Johnson on that Johnson Auto Body Honda with RBI Industries, Otis Moto, and Joe's Custom Cable going on to pick up the win, open pro class. For more information on the Beaver Motorcycle Club on Facebook, it's Beaver Cycle Club. Otter Street Fishing Club is T-H-E-O-S-F-C dot net. That's our website. On Facebook, it is Otter Street Fishing Club. Remember, the first Saturday in February, Lake Winnebago, Oshkosh, Wisconsin. Don't forget, TeamChicago.tv, WalkWithDan.com, and on YouTube, go to Dan Schmidt Motorcycle Racing.